Hi there, and welcome to another video on the Bite Size channel. My name is Mark, my handle on the forums is Andro, and today I'll be showing you how to use the pixel projection up. I'd just like you to pause the video and make what you see here. Great, let's get started. So I've got this rectangle on the screen, I'm gonna move it to the left. Now watch what happens if I resize the screen. It's position in relation to the left side and the top and the bottom, it changes, okay? So imagine we wanna get around that and I say, I want this rectangle to always be in the bottom left corner, no matter what. So we're gonna grab the pixel projection up and this simply remaps the 3D coordinate system of space into a 2D um, pixel coordinate system. So I'm gonna grab this and I'll drag it in. Now the rectangle disappeared because the rectangle has a width of one pixel and a height of one pixel. So let's put this in 100 and this in 100. Now we're looking at a quarter of the rectangle. I'm gonna click transform and now I have to use pixel values. So I've really gotta use values per pixel to move this around. Now let's say I put it on um, 50 by 50, so it's there. And now watch what happens. When I click and drag, this stays there, right? It's like its position is fixed. It's based upon the pixel coordinate system. If I'd want it to be in the top right corner, I could grab the width and the height. And as you can see, it's now always gonna be um, there, no matter what I do. And imagine I'd want it to be in the middle of the screen. I just do divide by two. And I do divide by two. Let me just move this down here so you can see what's happening. And now, no matter what, that will always be exactly in the center of the screen. So let me get rid of these. So I could now also grab the mouse up, which works with pixels, as you can see here. And I could get the position X and the position Y. And now this is always gonna be mapped to the screen, no matter what I set it to. Okay, great. Let's get rid of that. Last thing I wanna show you is, I'm gonna grab um, a cube here in 3D space. So this is not being affected by the pixel projection. I'm gonna make this rectangle a lot smaller. And now um, I can move this 3D cube around, but I wanna get its position with pixel coordinates. So we use an op called screen coordinates. And as you can see, I'm getting its pixel coordinates there. So I'm gonna grab this and plug it into X and watch what happens. So here we have a number of minus 0 0.18 but here it's 246 pixels. So from zero to over here, I could now grab Y and plug that in. And as you can see, it's here. So now when I move this around, that's following with the pixel coordinate system. Okay, that was an introduction to the pixel projection up. I hope this video has been educational and informative. If you've got any questions or comments, please feel free to leave them under the video below or to post them on the forums. Thanks for watching and have a good one. Bye.